David Nelson Crossway, Jr., African-American engineer, born 1892, died 1976. David Nelson Crossway, Jr. was a mechanical engineer who specialized in heating, ventilation, and air conditioning, or HVAC. During his long career with the C.A. Dunham Company, his research led to innovations in the field, and he received over 30 U.S. patents for HVAC apparatus. Crossweight was also a National Technological Association medalist in 1936, and the first African American honored by the American Society of Heating, Refrigeration, and Air Conditioning Engineers. Among his many accomplishments in is among his many accomplishments is the design for the heating system of New York's Radio City Music Hall. Crossweight was born in Nashville, Tennessee on May 27, 1892. Some sources list 1890, 1891, or 1898. To Dr. David Nelson and Minnie Harris Crossweight. He attended elementary and high school in Kansas City, Missouri, and studied mechanical engineering at Purdue University. In 1913, after receiving his Bachelor of Science degree, he began his long association with the C.A. Dunham Company. At Dunham, Crossweight progressed from engineering from engineer to engineering checker in 1915 to research engineer in 1919. During this time, he continued his education, earning his MS degree from Purdue in 1920, while also contributing to technical magazines, including power and industrial management. In 1925, Crossweight was named director of research, and five years later, he was promoted to technical advisor. As research director, Crossweight was responsible for heat transfer research, steam transport research, and application of the resistance thermometer principle of to thermostats. On May 3rd, 1930, Crossweight married E. Madeline Towles in Chicago, Illinois. They had one child, David Nelson III, who died before the age of six. Madeline died in August of 1939, and two years later, Crossweight married Blanche Ford. From 1930 until he retired in 1969, Crossweight remained a technical consultant and advisor to at C.A. Dunham, which later became Dunham Bush. He continued to conduct research on heating systems, including devising and applying techniques for reducing noise caused by steam and non-condensable gases in heating systems. Additionally, he was responsible for product and process development applications and the policies regarding these developments. Crossweight Nay continued Crossway continued contributing to the HVAC field as an author, rewriting chapters of the American Society of Heating and Ventilation Engineers Guide for the 1939, 1959, and 1967 editions. He also wrote articles for Heating and Ventilation magazine. Crossweight was active in technical societies including ASHRAE, the American Chemical Society, the National Society of Professional Engineers, and the American Association for the Advancement of Science. Crossweight was involved in community affairs as well, serving on the Northwest Comprehensive Health Planning Executive Committee and as president of the Michigan City Redevelopment Commission in his hometown of Michigan City, Indiana. He was also active in the Masons, having held the positions of Grand Junior Warden and Grand Senior Warden. In addition to receiving the NTA Medal, Crossway became the first African American to be honored for excellence in engineering when he was made a fellow of ASHRAE in 1971. In the spring of 1975, Crossway was honored by Purdue University with an honorary doctorate, honorary doctorate in technology. He enjoyed studying history, reading biographies, and listening to classical music. Crossway died on February 25, 1976, after a brief hospital stay. Citations are in the description.